Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice query problem? From what we have here, we can represent what is inside here as a letter. So let x be equals to root 3 minus 1 over 2. That is from here, this x over 1, and we can cross multiply. And this becomes 2x equals to root 3 minus 1 and here let's take 1 minus 1 to this side become plus so we have 2x plus 1 equals to root 3 from here and equally here we can square both sides square this side and also square this side here square cancel square root remain 3 then the expansion Expansion here give us 2x squared plus 1 square and plus 2 times 2x times 1 then equals to 3 from here and here this square affect 2 that's 4 so we have 4 then affect x we have x square 4 x square now then plus 1 square that's 1 then plus here we have 4x then equals to 3 and here let's bring 3 here so that we have 4x square plus 4x then plus 1 minus 3 equals to 0 that is here this is same thing as 4x square plus 4x minus 2 equals to 0 and when we separate 4x and minus 2 here we can equally say this is 4x square equals to minus 2 become 2 here then plus 4x become minus 4x here then we can keep this from here we are still going to be using this you know relation and then also we can reduce this further and we divide through by 2 and this becomes 2x square equals to here become 1 then minus 2x and we are still going to be using this relation now from this relation the last one here let's take the square on both sides so that we have 2x square all square equals to 1 minus 2x all square and here this square will affect 2 that's 4 and to affect x square that's x raised to power 4 then equals to here the expansion becomes 1 square plus 2x all square then minus 2 times 1 times 2x from here and when we simplify here we still have 4x raised to power 4 equals to here 1 squared as 1 then plus here this give us 4x square then minus 4x from here and from what we have here let's substitute what we have as 4x squared to this place and here we have 4x squared as 2 minus 4x and here this now becomes 4x raised to power 4 now equals to 1 plus instead of 4x squared now we have 2 minus 4x then minus 4x and simply put here yeah, this is now 4x raised to power 4 now equals to 1 plus 2 here that's 3 then minus 4x minus 4x that give us minus 8x then working further from here we can also square both sides of this equation again so we square this side and also we square this side then from what we have here 4 squared as 16 then x raised to power 4 squared as x raised to power 8 then equals to the expansion here become 3 square plus 8x squared then minus 2 times 3 times 8x 
and here this same thing as 16 x raised to power 8 equals to 3 square that's 9 then plus 8 square that's 64 then x square then here we have minus 2 times 3 times 8 we have 48 x from here that is from what we have there now we can separate what we have here which is 64 square as 16 times 4 square and this here becomes 16 x raised to power 8 now equals to 9 here we have plus 16 into bracket okay let's make it more simple that's 16 times 4 x square first then minus 48 x then since we have the relation for 4 x square as 2 minus 4 x then here this becomes 16 x raised to power 8 now equals to 9 plus 16 into bracket 2 minus 4 x now then minus 48 x then 16 can now open this bracket and here we have 16 x raised to power 8 equals to 9 plus 16 times 2 we have 32 then minus 16 times 4 here we have 64 x then minus 48 x here and when we walk further from here we can sum this together and here give us 16 x raised to power 8 now equals to 9 plus 32 here we have 41 then minus 1 and 12 x from here and also from what we have here we are interested in finding x raised to power 10 now since we have represented x as what is inside as root 3 minus 1 over 2 so now what we are interested in finding is now simply x raised to power 10 now which implies here we just need to multiply both sides by x squared then we should recall that we have from the relation we have 2x squared equals to 1 minus 2x then let's use 2x squared to multiply the left hand side and use 1 minus 2x to multiply the right hand side and here this becomes 16x raised to power 8 multiplied by 2x squared equals to here we have 41 minus 112x multiplied by 1 minus 2x and from here this becomes 32x raised to power 10 because here we have 8 plus 2 that's 10 then equals to here when we open this bracket 41 we multiply first then here we go 41 times 1 that's 41 minus here 41 times 2 that's 82x then also minus 112 multiply that's minus 112x then also we have plus 224x square from there then we can now simplify further again and here when we sum this up we have minus 184 and this gives us 32 x raised to power 10 equals to 41 here minus 194 x we can write 224 x square as 112 times 2 x square and also we should recall that 2 x square is 1 minus 2 x 
that is here we now have 32 x raised to power 10 now equals to 41 minus 194x then plus 112 into bracket 1 minus 2x from here and also when we open this bracket this then becomes here yeah, 32x raised to power 10 we now be equals to 41 then minus 194x then plus here yeah, this is 112 then minus 224x from here then also when we collect the like terms we can add 41 plus 112 and also minus 184x minus 224x bring it together then this becomes this becomes 32x raised to power 10 that equals to we have 153 minus 418x from here then from what we have let's substitute the value of x which is root 3 minus 1 over 2 so what we have here that is here we now have 32 x raised to power 10 equals to 153 minus 4 into bracket root 3 minus 1 over 2 from here and since this multiplied 2 can go here 1 2 go here we have 2 or a name and here we now have 32 x raised to power 10 equals to 153 minus 2 or a name times root 3 minus 1 from here and also here 2 or a name can open this bracket and we have 32 x raised to power 10 then it goes to 153 minus 2 or a name root 3 then plus 2 or a name from here and also when we sum 153 and 2 or a name we have 3 or 62 then we, we have 32 x raised to power 10 now it goes to 3 or 62 minus 2 or a name root 3 and we cannot divide through by 32 to get x raised to power 10 and here left with x raised to power 10 which is equals to 362 divided by 32 then minus 2 or a name root 3 divided by 32 and on this side we can reduce this and here we have x raised to power 10 now equals to 181 over 16 then minus 2 or an a root 3 over 32 so here we have the final answer to this given problem that is from what we have here the result is simply 181 over 16 minus 2 and 9 with 3 over 32. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos. Turn the notification bell on. See you next class and bye for now.